Hey guys and girls, welcome back or welcome to my YouTube channel. In today's video, I'm getting a freshen up of the tint in the Toyota FJ Cruiser. The reason I'm getting a freshen up on the tint is because it got scratched up pretty bad over the years. And Andrew's inside there having a bit of a go at it now. So let's see what Andrew does to fix up my tinting in my FJ. Let's go. I don't think there's much dust in there. No. That used to be blue. Yeah, I know. Sometimes you can tell. This is like just a release line head, so that keeps that nice and clean. It's the adhesive side. Obviously, not that clean. Not working the way you want it to. It's not just going as smooth as I would have liked it's it. It's all right. We'll, just, we'll do it on the other side. <laughs> no, now can you take it off and do it all over again? <laughs> Why can't you do that? Can't you just take it off, do it again? Yeah, you can. I'll put a cut a new bit of film though because it's going to be dirty. From the edges, it sucks in debris. Oh, yeah. No, no, that's all right. We'll do it. Yeah, it's stinky glue this mm. one. Sometimes you can tell the uh, brand of the film by the smell of the, the glue. It's easy. So it's all about the prep? All about the prep. Not all about it, but a lot of it for sure. If you get your prep wrong, you need to get a good job. Forbies are definitely more difficult because of all the dust that's already impregnated into all these daily channels and stuff. There you go, ain't that easy? What about me bubbles? Bubbles are extra. <laughs> we can leave them in if you like, but most people don't like them. No. So they're looking for 35, that's coming at 33, there's a 5% tolerance. So that's well within, uh, well, well within tolerance. 33% and legal. And legal. And legal. And probably a lot better, uh, a lot better energy efficiency out of it. Nano ceramic film. For you, Ed, nothing but the best. Thanks, mate. You get out and about in the sun, we've got to protect that beautiful face of yours. Um, it's a great heat rejection, and 
looks fantastic. It does, doesn't it? Yeah. Now for the back window. Now for the back window. Wouldn't have hurt to give this a bit of a gurney yet before it comes. Oh, uh, sorry, mate. For any uh, work. Oh, crikey. I'm guessing you don't want any of that under your film, do you? No, I wouldn't want any of that. I'd say a little bit of. Yeah, it's not too bad. Not too bad. Compared to what? Uh, compared to what it could be. At least the seals work, so. So, what, you decided to put it on the inside instead of the outside now? Yeah, I thought I'd look after you, Ed. Yeah, thanks, mate. Apparently, you're a good bloke. So, some people say. Yeah, I know. So this is going to give you 100% UV protection and also if you're uh, unlucky enough to get a rock onto the window and break your rear screen, this will hold it together somewhat. So this is the clear one we put on here? Yep. Because we wanted to... Well, you need to stay legal. Legal. You don't want to be illegal, Ed, do you? No, well, no not now. I'm older and wiser. Not older. Older. Yeah. Done. You're welcome, Ed. <laughs> right, Andrew. Thanks for doing the tint for us. Now, as for care for my window tint, should I just use the stuff I buy from the shop? You can, as long as it's ammonia free, Ed. Yeah? When you made your free window cleaner will be fine or the trade secret a couple of drops of dishwashing liquid into a spray bottle and give them a nice white paper wow. for soft cloth Amazing. don't even have to buy it you've already got it at home under your sink have a look you do well guys that's the tint done by andrew now i paid full retail i did ask him for a discount and apparently he said no because i drank his coffee window tint done by a professional and i'm a happy man so hopefully i'll get a few more years out of this one guys don't forget hit that like and subscribe and i'll see you in the next video Bye for now. Bye professional. <laughs> See.